And now, Hodag Artist Interviews. Brought to you by News Channel 7, your local news and weather authority. Happy Hodag number 36. This is Terry T. along with the legendary Leroy Van Dyke, the sharpest dressed guy on stage all weekend long. Well, I try to keep my hair combed and try to put on clean clothes about every day if I can. Now, you were at Hodag number one. I was at number one, number 12. And uh, one somewhere a little later on there. I think this is about my fifth or sixth one. I can't wait to hear walk on by. Well, you will wait. I can't, I'm not going to do it now. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, it'll be fine. And we, uh, since, since the last time we were here, uh, Billboard magazine ha did some research. And they determined that walk on by, based on plays, sales, and number of weeks in the charts, is the biggest country single of all time. So I've got to do it again today. You got to. Maybe maybe sing it twice. If they want it, I'll do it, yeah. In all your years, is there one hold that that stands out for you? Yeah, the first one. Um, I didn't think it would make it, seriously. There were only a couple, 300 people here, and I, I, I played a lot of outdoor events. A lot of them made it, a lot of them didn't. This didn't look too promising. But the next year it got a little bigger, and the next year a little bigger, and next year, and now see what's happened. Do you by chance have an auctioneering gig lined up after this? Uh, no, uh, I've always got auctioneering things coming up, yeah, but not right after this. He's the sharpest dressed guy on the stage this year, and he smells pretty good, too. <laughs> Leroy Van Dyke, knock him dead. Thank you so much.